you ever wanted to be the Lord of the Rings? Well, with this update, you're going to be very close to being one, at least when it comes to Google My Maps. Yep, with this update, we have the ability to create rings of pins, as you can see in this picture. Let me zoom in. Yep, does that look interesting? So, we can control the number of rings. We can control a number of things, but we can all we can control the number of rings. Um, we can control the radius. It's the distance between each of the rings, as well. And this is this is the 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 first. This is a baby, yeah. Which is just born out of Staxio, and. Um, Staxio now creates multiple KML files and um, this first uh, update, this first uh, version allows us to... I'll show you. All right. Yeah. Let's, let's do a build, right? So you guys can take a look. And look at, look at the... Uh, this is a ridiculous amount of information here. But let's do a build. Let's go to the local SEO on the planner and let's get a business so let's go to maps.google.com and let's pick a random thing well not a random thing let's pick the previous business we were working with on the videos that we've released a few days ago just to keep things a little bit more consistent, right? So this is not a service area business. This is a regular business with an address. Uh, you can see there's an address on this business. Um, if you want to take a look at why we have this field, um, there's look at the previous video we just published three days ago, I think. Now, keywords. Let's add some keywords in this, uh, in this build, right? Coffee shop, good breakfast, brunch place. Okay, good enough. You can do a maximum of 20. Okay, I'm gonna scroll down. And article, short and sweet. Okay, uh, for the points of interest in driving direction, made a couple of changes here on the user interface whereas before we had a switch I was enabling and disabling this uh, section of the maps builder maps builder will build everything for you makes no sense to you know enable disable stuff when you should be building everything out for you All right points of interest I'm gonna do bake but not bank I want bakery bakery and I want cafe in radius in a five kilometer radius around my business not my business but the business we're working with okay and bakeries and coffee shops right good move on moving on i'm gonna do directions to, i'm just gonna do from and i'm gonna do all of them it's all right and now here's the here's the new baby the new feature we just added to stack seal my maps kml files yeah Configure the rings for Google My Maps. Rings, how many? You can do up to 20, right? Which is what I did with this example. I did 20, right? If this is what you want to do, go ahead. So I want to do maybe five. With a 500, 500 um, radius, between each of the rings okay so this is the distance between it's this ring and this ring and this ring and this ring between all the rings 500 meter okay that's what the that's what the setting is for okay i'm gonna keep it at 500 because i like it randomize no it's all good so i'm gonna do let's do a build map and i'm gonna pause the video and come back when this build is complete 
Okay, build is complete. Let's look at the project. Let's open the spreadsheet or the folder. So open the folder because I want you guys to know that we have two KML files to import into my maps. One is the uh, driving directions, the business, and the and the data that we had um, before this update. So this is the regular data. And then we have an extra KML file with the rings. Okay. So how are we going to import this into my maps? Let's go into, yeah, let's do it like this to create a new my map, right? Google my, sorry, this is in Portuguese. Okay. Google my maps, find the Google my maps, uh, new item, create and share. Yes, exactly. Create. Okay. I have a my map brilliant so import exactly this is exactly what we're going to do import we're gonna oh wait okay wait before we do this we need to download so i'm going to right click on with my mouse and transfer or click the transfer button here right i'm going to transfer this one with the button okay downloaded both files brilliant now my map let's load the files into my map Okay, let's start with the uh, original KML file that Staxio was creating. Here we go. The business, driving directions, the center of the business. We did also a couple of updates here on the uh, information on the pins and the roads as, as we've updated this, this data. It has more data now. Okay, all right. So this is the original KML file. You want to add a set? Let's add a second one. So we add a new layer. Okay. Adding a new layer. I clicked on the add layer link. Now import. I'm going to import the second KML file with the rings. Open. Boom. So I did how many? Five, I think. One, two, three, four, five. Let me check. Let me check. Let me check. Let me check. Yeah, five. Brilliant. There's my five rings around my business. And all the information is so so oops. Uh, here, this layer. Let's disable this layer for a minute. See you can enable and disable the layers also if you want to. Yeah? Good. Understood? Very good. Okay, so this is all the data you get the cap the information here business name business address business phone business website status rating total ratings uh bunch of information here here are all the links okay all the links that are on the spreadsheet that's actually created for us for this project which is this one links from the spreadsheet all these links here from the spreadsheet are added to our my map these are the links. They're all in here. Eat to one to one individual, like separate pin for each, right? Okay. Now, what else? Let me enable this layer. Okay. Does that look good? What do you think? Yeah. It can be the Lord of the, uh, Lord of the Rings. All right. Um, it's pretty much what I wanted you guys to be aware of that Staxio can do with this uh, brand new feature, and uh, we're gonna be we're gonna be adding uh, more interesting features to this Lord of the Rings, Lord of the SEO Rings feature, okay, of Staxio, which uh, I think you're gonna be you're gonna find them to be very very interesting. So stay tuned, and I'll see you in the next video. Take care.